नमस्कार आई एम डी वेलकम टू इन डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग प्रोग्राम टुडे इज थर्टी एथ अप्रिल इफ बी सी टुडे इज हाईलाइट सो वी आर मैंशनिंग थ्री हाईलाइट फर्स्ट इज दैट हीट वेव टू सी वेव कंडीशन लाइकली टू कंटिन्यू ओवर ईस्ट इंडिया ड्यूरिंग नेक्स्ट थ्री डेज टिल सेकेंड मे एंड देर इज ए पॉसिबिलिटी ऑफ रिडक्शन ग्रेजुअली देर आफ्टर एंड सेकेंड पॉइंट इज दैट हीट वेव कंडीशन लाइकली टू कंटिन्यू ओवर साउथ नेशनल इंडिया ड्यूरिंग नेक्स्ट फाइव डेज एंड थर्ड पॉइंट इज दैट हैवी रेनफॉल along with thunderstorm lightning gust winds likely to continue over north east india during next 3 4 days so these are three highlights abc yesterday's realized weather so mainly uh, there are heat wave conditions and uh, warm night conditions so heat wave to severe heat wave conditions reported at uh, many to most pockets over gangetic west bengal and in some pockets over odisha and uh, bihar and the severe heat wave conditions at one or two locations also reported over saurashtra area mainly diu region and heat wave conditions also prevailed at one or two locations over konkan telangana interior karnataka and northern parts of kerala so these are the heat wave conditions and uh, warm night conditions also reported at one or two locations over uh, severe warm night conditions reported over odisha and warm night conditions over the west bengal Bihar, eastern parts of Madhya Pradesh, interior Karnataka, and interior Maharashtra, mainly over Maratwada and Madhya Maharashtra. So this is about uh, heat wave conditions and uh, warm night conditions. Heat wave to sea wave conditions also reported at some locations over southern parts of some island West Bengal. As regards heavy rainfall, so heavy rainfall and snowfall reported at uh, isolated pockets over uh, Jammu Kashmir and Himachal Pradesh. and hail storm also reported uh, at uh, one or two stations over punjab madhya pradesh and vidarbha region in addition to this light to moderate rainfall reported at uh, many places over northeast india including arunachal pradesh assam meghalaya and some pockets of uh, nagaland and mizoram tripura and uh, light to moderate rainfall also reported over uh, some uh, locations over punjab uttarakhand and uh, some parts of south western india including tamil nadu kerala etc abc temperature scenario so these are the pockets of east india south western india west india including konkan region including mumbai also and some parts of saurashtra and uh, kutch region where temperatures are above normal by uh, more than 4 degrees celsius and in eastern parts of the country including gangetic west bengal odisha and bihar region there are temperature of pockets above normal by 4 to 7 degrees celsius and 4 to 8 degrees celsius over gangetic west bengal so we can say that eastern parts of the country and south western india and along the west coast temperatures are above normal above normal category and some locations of north east india also including assam meghalaya nagaland manipur mizoram tripura and sikkim region their temperatures are above normal otherwise over central parts of the country north west parts of the country temperature either normal category or below normal category abc some of the highest reported yesterday maximum temperature some of the uh some of the stations uh, uh including kalaikunda in gangetic west bengal reported 45.4 degrees celsius and also same uh, temperature of the order of 45.4 degrees celsius reported in kandla station of saurashtra and kutch and 45 degrees celsius in nandial in raylseema and uh, so some of the uh, some of the highest uh, reported temperatures are uh, reported here for your ready reference and if we see today's synoptic system so today based on disturbance seen as a cyclone circulation over north pakistan and darjeeling uh, regions and uh, there is a cyclone circulation uh, over northeast parts of the bangladesh and new road another cyclone circulation of north east assam there is a trough runs from bihar to manipur across this cyclone circulation over northeast bangladesh in low tropical levels and there is a wind discontinuity or trough runs from south eastern parts of madhya pradesh to south interior karnataka across uh, marathwada and in north interior karnataka and there is a cyclone circulation over south tamil nadu so these are some of the uh, synoptic conditions which are favorable for uh, weather systems so accordingly these are the five days weather warnings uh, for heat wave so you can see that red color is given because of persistence of heat wave to severe heat wave conditions over gangetic west bengal odisha and bihar region and orange color is given to jharkhand samvalan 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 west bengal andhra pradesh interior karnataka and kutch region and saurashtra region and yellow color is given 
to eastern parts of Madhya Pradesh, Telangana, interior Maharashtra, including uh, Maradwada, Madhya Maharashtra, and also to Konkan, yellow color, and Kerala. On 1st of May, again red color is continue for heat wave to severe wave conditions over Bihar, Gangetic West Bengal, and Odisha, and orange color is given to Southern Island West Bengal, Jharkhand, Andhra Pradesh, interior Karnataka, and the Saurashtra region, and yellow color is uh, given to heat wave uh, condition uh, to Telangana, interior Maharashtra, mainly Madhya Maharashtra, Maratwala, and uh, coastal Maharashtra, including Konkan, and to Kerala and Tamil Nadu. On 2nd of May, again, red color, color is continue uh, to Bihar, Gangetic West Bengal, Odisha, and uh, Rail Sima red color is given on 2nd of May, and yellow color is given to Jharkhand, Telangana, Tamil Nadu, and Kerala and orange color is, give, uh, color is given to Southern Island, West Bengal and Saurashtra region. On 3rd of May, again, red color is continue for Rail Sima and orange color is uh, now given to Bihar, Negative West Bengal, Odisha and Coastal Andhra Pradesh and uh, interior Karnataka and Saurashtra region and yellow color is given to Jharkhand, Telangana and Tamil Nadu region. On 4th of May, again, red color is continue for Rail Sima and orange color is given to Bihar, Andhra Pradesh, especially coastal Andhra Pradesh, interior Karnataka, and yellow color is given to yellow color is given to Gangetic West Bengal, Odisha, and Telangana region. So these are some of the locations, uh, mainly over eastern parts of the country and south and western India, and also including Maharashtra and Saurashtra region, where heat wave conditions to receive heat wave conditions likely during next five days, and warm night conditions also expected to occur over Bihar, Gangetic West Bengal, Odisha eastern parts of Madhya Pradesh and north into Karnataka today and more or less same conditions likely to continue during next three days and thereafter on third burn air condition is given to eastern parts of Madhya Pradesh and north into Karnataka and same is expected on 4th of May. ABC uh, weather warning in respect of heavy rainfall so today heavy rainfall is expected over Arunachal Pradesh and uh, Assam Meghalaya on 1st of May very heavy rainfall is expected over Arunachal Pradesh and heavy rainfall over Assam Meghalaya and uh, uh, Nagaland, Manipur, Mizoram, Tripura. On 2nd of May, very heavy rainfall is expected over Arunachal Pradesh, Assam, Nagaland, Manipur, Mizoram, Tripura, and extremely heavy rainfall is expected at one or two stations in Meghalaya on 2nd of May. And on 3rd, this intensity will reduce, and again, heavy rainfall is expected over Nagaland, Manipur, Mizoram, Tripura. And on 4th, no heavy rainfall warning has been issued by IMD. Accordingly, you can see that today fairly widespread rainfall is expected over Jammu Kashmir and scattered rainfall over Himachal Pradesh and isolated rainfall over Uttarakhand and uh, Punjab areas. And uh, isolated rainfall is expected over eastern parts of Madhya Pradesh, Bidharva, Chhattisgarh, and Maratwala region, Odisha, coastal Andhra Pradesh, and South Western India, including South Indian Karnataka, Tamil Nadu, and scattered rainfall over Lakshadweep and uh, Kerala. Kerala and fairly widespread to widespread rainfall is expected over northeast India today and as well the activity is expected over Sikkim region. On 1st of May, more or less same condition likely to continue over northeast India and uh, rainfall will reduce over western Mar region, only isolated, isolated activity is expected on 1st of May over Jammu Kashmir, Himachal Pradesh and Uttarakhand and no weather warning and no uh, rainfall is expected over parts of central India, western parts of the country, only south western India including Kerala and Tamil Nadu and some little possibility of isolated rainfall over Odisha, otherwise no rainfall is expected over any parts of the country except northeast India. The spell of uh, rain over northeast India is already mentioned, likely to continue over uh, uh, these pockets, mainly Arunachal Pradesh, Assam Meghale, Nagaland, Manipur, Mizoram, Tupra during the next 4-5 days. So these are the weather distributions in respect of different parts of the country. Now we will uh, discuss in uh, very short that we have given red uh, color to Gangetic West Bengal, Odisha, Bihar, and Rail Sima. So, accordingly, uh, there are some impacts and the suggestions uh, uh, from IMD that very high likelihood of developing heat illness and heat stroke in all ages of these locations. And extremely uh, extreme care is needed for vulnerable people of uh, these locations. And again, again, orange alert areas we have mentioned uh, in our discussion that somewhere in West Bengal, Coastal Andhra Pradesh, Telangana, Interior Karnataka and Jharkhand where orange color is given. So they, these are some of the uh, some of the suggestions and the possible impact uh, because of high uh, temperature accordingly. Uh, some of we can read that drink sufficient water even if not thirsty, avoid heat, ex avoid heat exposure, use ORS etc. So there are so many suggestions uh, on daily life you can uh, 
uh, follow and uh, so this is uh, all about today's discussion we will update tomorrow till then namaskar jain jai bharat